I'm Sean O'Shea with Kauai America Corporation, and I have been privileged to be invited into the home of Mary Beth and Stephen Curtis Chapman. Stephen, you've been a Kauai artist, frankly, longer than I've been with the company. Now tell me how that all got started. When did you first play your first Kauai piano? Well, it's kind of fun when you mention Kauai the first time I played one or, or uh, was introduced to the name. I grew up in Paducah, Kentucky, a little town in western Kentucky where words like kawaii aren't a normal part of our uh, daily language um, unless you put a y'all at the end of it. Um, it's kawaii, y'all. Um, and, and so I remember I grew up uh, in a music store. My dad owned a music store, Chapman Music, still there in, in Paducah. And for a season, he moved in, he kind of partnered with a guy that I had grown up with, great, actually a great musician, great piano player, uh, could just wail on B3 and all that. His name was Chuck Whitby, and I remember we grew up together, and, um, and I always knew he was a really great piano player. And, and my dad moved into this big store where there were pianos and organs, and, and um, he sold, Chuck sold Kauai. That was kind of his main piano. And... Uh, I remember him just bragging and going on and on. Man, these are great. You know, it's kind of a new, you know, new thing that I've discovered. But, you know, love these pianos, love the sound of them. And so something sort of, I think at that point, you know, registered for me. I was, gosh, probably 10 or 11 years old. Um, and, but, you know, that that's, that's a great, you know, and that's how I learned to pronounce it, you know, because he knew how to pronounce it too. It wasn't K-Way-I or, or whatever. And um, when I decided uh, 20... Two years ago or something, maybe my wife and I, uh, I went looking for my first acoustic, you know, grand piano to put in our in our home that we had built, and um, uh, I just I knew I wanted I knew what I wanted want to sound like because at this point I'd recorded I'd made a couple of records I'd gone in studios I had guys say now that's a great sound an old, you know, piano and you know just kind of lock away that's what I want one to sound like really you know, warm, but still have the brightness when you dug into it and had all the response that you wanted. And again, still not a piano player, but I knew when I was writing, I knew what I wanted it to feel like. So I went into Shuff's Music. I remember I went through and played all the pianos that they had. And, and I didn't have in my mind, it's, it's going to have to be a Kauai or it's going to have to be, you know, this or that brand. Just, I just wanted to find the best piano. Um, and with the plan that I would record this as well, potentially set up mics, and, and it wasn't going to go in my recording studio, but I'd run mic lines to be able to record it, run them to my studio. So I went in, I played every piano that they had, and, um, and I came to this one, sat down. It was white, of course. My wife's like, anything but the white piano. I mean, we're not going Liberace here. You're going to set a big candelabra on it, you know. But I sat down, it was a Kauai, and I played it and said, this is the piano. This is the one, if I'm going to record it, if I want one, that it's going to inspire me to write songs. This is the piano. And again, uh, it was a quad. Um, came time to uh, get a piano for this room in, in a new construction, a new house that we've been blessed to, to uh, have and um, still have my, my white quad uh, piano in my recording studio now, sitting proudly in my studio in the tracking room. And, um, and then didn't even, at this point, by, by this point, it wasn't even, you know, I didn't even go looking anywhere else because I knew. Uh, it's it's going to be a Kauai and have played exclusively really Kauai digital pianos uh, in concert because I think they just are the most true to uh, a real piano sound that you can get from plugging something in that's digital. Uh, so I'm a big fan and a, and a, a great uh, lover of Kauai, the, the people, uh, the pianos, um, the music that come out of them. I think the best thing I could say is they just they inspire me. Um, have continued to inspire me through the years, so I'm very thankful for, for Kauai. Stephen, I, I love that you, you wrap that up with, with how the piano inspires you, because that, that really is a goal at Kauai, isn't it? Really what music should be all about is the inspiration that comes from it. And I want you to know that you've inspired us at Kauai, and me personally, and my wife, you've inspired us with your music and your story. You have a beautiful family. You're a great human being. I'm personally very, very proud to have you with the Kauai artist family. So thank you for everything that you do. And thanks so much for inviting us into your home today. Oh, absolutely. Thank you. Brother. See you soon. Thanks, everyone, for watching.